Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Hurricane here today, and what I'm bringing you guys today is a ton of really, really cool information about the new Zombies DLC, Bridging the Gap. I will be showing loading screen, along with analyzing old characters returning, as long as a new mystery character or a silhouette character that is hinted between the two map packs. I will be analyzing not only the Bridging the Gap loading screen, but the Die Rise old loading screen, so you guys can see what I'm talking about, along with the Nuketown Zombies loading screen and the Green Run. Now, everything, real quick before this video starts, I just wanted to say two people that really helped make this video and had it go was Mr. James Gary and OG X-Rays. They helped out a ton with making this video and a ton with constructing the idea. So definitely go check them out. They are some really good YouTubers that I recommend you guys go check out. And another thing is this video did take a ton of time to make. So if you guys can just, you know, drop a like or not, you know, it all is up to you. But it just did take a ton of time and it would be greatly appreciated if I could see your support. And also subscribe if you haven't already so you never miss when I upload a video. I'm going to have a ton of new DLC stuff out for you along with zombie challenges and a ton of other stuff. But now let's actually get into the DLC stuff. Now, in terms with the bridging the gap loading screen, now it has been leaked and I will be showing that in this video, but first we need to go and do a little backtrack. Now for the green run, all these loading screens definitely have something in common. Now look at this, this is the die rise loading screen. Now in the corner, in the left hand corner, you guys have a rip, which is the rip for the Nuketown Zombies loading screen, and in the right you have the silhouette of a guy. I will be putting them together and analyzing them for you guys later so you guys can see a uh, closer in look of what they look like together so you can see this new mystery silhouette character possibly this meaning that the old characters will be returning which I think is really cool now here's the hinted bridging the gap loading screen as you guys can see here there is a silhouette of the guy in the corner uh, just like it was in uh, Die Rise but in this time it's the opposite side so it's almost like these two are connecting um, also Oh, when I connect them together, you guys will see them side by side, so you can see the new silhouette character right here. I will also be highlighting it just in case for some reason you can't see the formation. And uh, it forms this new silhouette character, like a hidden character. Now, I could not find any character that looked closer to him that has been the old Zombies games. So is this a new character? Could this mean a symbol for the old characters are returning? I really want to hear you guys' thoughts in the comment section below about this whole bridging the gap thing. You know, I made a video and everyone commented, or a, a good part of you guys are and maybe not even you guys commented that it was fake when a matter of fact that as we're seeing now there's a ton of information that is leading up to this now bridging the gap obviously you have die rise and then you had something that's a great leap forward now in bridging the gap you have the title bridging the gap like it was great leap forward then you have the hinge and then you have dirk hammer which would match up with die rise now the hinge what my buddy James helped me out with. The Hinge, you know, when you look it up on Google and you try and type it in, which I really recommend you guys do yourself, you'll find nothing that really comes up until you come across that something really, really cool. Basically, The Hinge was a secret zombie experiment. And you know that Nazis, what they did, it was so secret, they ended up killing off their scientists just to keep it safe. And uh, I'm, I'm serious about this, just to keep the project safe, which is, I can definitely see the Nazis doing. That's not too far off to what they would normally do. Um, so The Hinge, what it basically was, is it was, like a time travel machine just like the one in Doris and here's the picture again of the silhouette characters together uh, but back to what I was saying the hinge uh, what it does is it basically it was an underground like time travel project especially dealing with the secret project that the Nazis have so the hinge and then what you come to Dirk Hammer travel or translates to the chamber now as you guys see in the loading screen if you guys didn't see it you can back it up in the video their chamber there looks like a ton of underground stuff that really relates to actual history with the hinge with the underground chamber the secret Nazi experiment along with uh, the pictures of the loading screen for a great leap. I'm sorry for uh, bri bridging the gap, and then also another thing in the opening cinematic intro for Die Rise, you had uh, Samuel or one of the goats said, "What do you mean mend the rift?" And mend the rift, if you look it up, it basically means like closing a time gap, and this is what bridging the gap can come up with. Bridging the gap. So you know, there's just a ton of information about this thing actually being real, and I really recommend that you guys look it into yourself. A ton of information, a ton of time went into gathering information for this video. So if you guys could leave a like, that be greatly appreciated and like i said subscribe if you're new anyway guys that's been it for me make sure to leave your comments in the comment section below i'm out peace